Praise the Lord, everyone. Brother Roop here. I got uh, several new books in. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six books. Six books to added to my library. First one is Apostolic History Outline. I already had the PDF printed out. It's a really, really great outline. It's not a book, but an outline. But it's very informative. And all these books, all six books I bought are from the Reverend Mar Marvin M. Arnold, uh, D.D., T.H.D. That means uh, Doctor of Divinity and Doctor of Theology. So he's a doctor two times over. Uh, he was born in 1921. He, he passed away, but I don't know which year. So. so anyway, Apostolic History Outline, pretty good book. I already got it highlighted. 80, 100, 200, 80, 1100, 1200. It goes from every 100 years, and he has the Catholic system and Epistolic Church history side by side. For every 100 years, every page is 100 years. So, very, very good. Of course, it's an outline, it's not a regular book. So, very informative. Um, one criticism of this book is that he speaks very harshly of Catholics. Uh, probably more so than he really needs to. So, anyway. Next book is The Origin and Spread of Man. Of course, by uh, Marvin Arnold. Oh, got a card. Thank you, card. How about that? Contents, The Origin of Man, Geography of Genesis Eden. That could be interesting. Sumerians, Antediluvian language, Antediluvian writing. Ooh. Domestic life of pre-flood people. Pre-flood humanity. So he really talks about the pre-flood people, so that could be interesting. Haven't read it yet, but that's pretty, pretty thick book. The archaeology went on here, and uh, this will be a pretty good read here. So let's see what like he does. Archaeology. Uh, Archaeology. <laughs> so, here's the next one. Christian Church History. Of course, Marvin Arnold. Volume 1. Okay, contents. Background of the seven churches. The Judaic Christian Church. Great preachers of Christianity. Asian Primitive Christianity, the Church of Ephesus. Ooh. I fought with beasts at Ephesus. Whoa, that should be good. For the Church at Sperna. So it's like the seven churches. Pretty thick book. It's uh, pretty thick. Over about 250 pages. So, looks like a pretty good read here. Seven books of Asia, yeah. So, the Bible, Trinity, and Matthew 28, 19. Oh, that's going to be a good one. It's a kind of a moderately thick book. Education. Preface. Glossary of Terms. The Codex Vaticanus. Interesting. Chapter 1, Catholicism, Roman Catholic System. So... Oh, 
Here's the, the good doctor himself, the author. He uh, started preaching in 1943 during World War II. He was uh, in the Army Air Corps in Africa. And so that's where he started preaching. So there is the Bible Trinity in Matthew 28, 19. Pretty good. I've already got this book, but uh, I got all these, the other five books as a package deal, and this one came with it, but I already have the copy of this book, so I may just give this book away to someone. So, it's a pretty good book. It's, let's see, Perversion of Religious History, Divine New Testament, Law of Longevity, Billy's Island, Wonders Apostolic Colony. Now, that's something I wanted to, I got some information about Billy's Island last year and lost it. The Great Azusa Meeting, events that led up to Azusa, Jesus Name, Water Baptism, Revival, or Lap Revival. So, Pentecost before, before Azusa. So, I'll probably give this copy away to someone. Last book of the same author. Marvel Arnold, Nicaea and the Nicene Council of AD 325. Kind of an interesting book, kind of thin, not real thick, but it's really a specialized book, specializing in the Council of Nicaea. Introduction. Yeah, it was basically uh, uh, against the Arians, and it was started by Arius. And Arius was uh, started Arianism, which is uh, the old name for Jehovah Witness. They hold the same doctrine as Jehovah Witness. Um, father, son, basically the father is son in the, the, the son is a lesser God than the father. So, of course, uh, I'm apostolic. I believe in one God. So, there's my uh, pile of new books. Looks like I'll be busy for a while. Thank you and uh, God bless you.